Alright, so we are once again outside of my garage, and I swapped out another opener. Um, replaced the Craftsman with an opener that uses this remote, one button tombstone. <laughs> Here we are. This is the Genie Pro screwdriver for my on store. Uh, it is the model CM8600-XL-M, and I'm using it with its original rail, trolley arm, uh, limit switches, got the original wall button to it, and this remote is the original remote. So this is actually the last uh, Genie screwdrive I have that I can currently show up on this door. Um, I do have still the Let's see and actually I've shown all of them on the mini door as well uh, But I have that CM 7600, but that one is locked up needs a new motor and I have my H 6000 a but that one there's something that's not quite right with that that I need to figure out, but This is the last genie I have for now uh, if you look close you'll notice that um, well it actually, we don't see a sketchy hang job up there. And I'm going to pull down the ladder here so I can show you how I hung it this time. Uh, last time that I did a genie like this one, which was the GX9000, uh, I had the back hangs look pretty stupid. This time I figured out a way. Um, you can kind of see what I got going on up there, so let's see. Comes back and over to the front. Uh, this works much better. Looks way cleaner and yeah. Um, it does still scrape against the rail, unfortunately. Excuse me, unfortunately, but it's not that big of a deal. So yeah, and this thing does run pretty well up here. Um, it's actually it's actually really quiet. Uh, the light lens does vibrate some, but it actually is a pretty quiet machine. Um, this right here, by the way, well, let's see, there's the Siege Craftsman, by the way. Uh, this is the other original remote to it. This would come with two remotes, and this is the keypad that was on it. It's a model ACS D1G. I don't have this program right now, and this one does not have a battery in it. But, we'll go ahead and run the unit from inside here with the remote. So yeah, you can hear the light lens vibrating uh, quite a bit on it, but I've got the one-piece rail, and of course the usual header mount that I have to do with these. Run it back up. So it is a pretty quiet machine. Um, let's run that with the wall console here. And if I didn't already mention, this is the original button. And I might have the down limit set a little bit too far, but it's all right. As usual, have my sensors installed up by the opener, but I did set the force so that it will go back up if it hits something. Um, other than that, I mean, it's just a genie screwdriver. I do really like this one though. Um, this opener's been on this channel for quite a while, and I don't know, it is kind of nice seeing it up here. Maybe sometime soon I'll have to get the 8165 from my aunt's garage up here as well. But for now, there you have it. That is the Genie Pro screwdriver on the small door. So thanks for watching. See you guys later.